This is the message for December 7th, 2014. Greetings, dear ones. It is a week for the structuring of light, the forming of the light of the global network of the light of Genesis for Earth. It is a week of light, the movement of light to structure the great new hub of light, a great new center of light for Earth. It is a week of the movement of light in this blessed holy season of light. It is a time for the upliftment of all aspects of existence. Every aspect of the precious experience precious expressions of creation receives the blessings of this sublime light. It is the holy season of light, and in this cherished holy season, dear ambassadors of star light, we make steps of preparation for the accomplishment of this mighty new center of light. The gate through which radiant light and knowledge shall flow to all. We have taken steps of preparation for this blessed installment of the first gate, the beloved eminent western gate. Today we continue with our steps of illumined action steps of action to support the structuring of this great light for creation. Through these steps of action, we prepare the pathway for the arrival of light, light of the opening of the eminent western gate of knowledge, light of the blessed golden gate tool which is formed in the presence of this great installment of light for earth. In the presence of the opening of the mighty gate, a great sparkle of light is released. This sparkle comes to us in the form of knowledge and in the form of the commemorative master tools of light, the golden gate and silver gates. These tools of light establish great light for the designated household. The techniques for the use of these blessed tools will be offered in the first course of knowledge of the eminent western gate, the course of the architecture of Genesis. Now, dear ambassadors, we have cleared the dwelling and we have enlivened the dwelling with the radiance of the light of the great teacher. Each room has received the blessings of the presence of the great teacher. Each room is prepared now for the light of the opening of the eminent western gate. And this light is brought into the household through the blessed golden gate. The golden gate brings the light to the designated location. This master tool is a fixed wheel, a precious golden gate, and establishes security and blessings for the specified location. Today we will continue our steps of preparation for the arrival of light. The arrival of the golden gate within the dwelling. We will position the following tools at the doorways leading into the house. We will prepare each doorway 
by placing our own master tool, the blessed pendant of eternal light, at the doorway surrounded by two super cells, a super star cell and a super water cell. Two super cells, each cell on one side of the blessed pendant of eternal light. These may be placed on a small surface or table directly facing the entrance. Or they may be placed on a table which stands on either side of the entrance. The importance is in the near proximity to the doorway. In a home, there may be a number of doorways leading in and out of the dwelling. We will allow this set of master tools to bless each doorway for a full 24-hour period, a full day and a full night. If there are three doorways leading to the outside, it will require three days time to achieve this preparation. If there are more, it will require a longer period of days. If our dwelling is within an enclosed structure, such as a single unit within a complex of units, then we will select only the doors which are leading to the exit of the building. Yes, each doorway will receive this awakening of Genesis Fusion in preparation for the installment of the Eminent Gate and the arrival of the Golden Gates. Are there questions? And then he paused. And so I asked him, uh, how about a door leading out to a porch or a patio? Should we put the tools by that door as well? Here's his answer. If one may exit the structure through the porchway, then we will perform the energizing procedure on that doorway. And then I also asked, do the tools have to be placed on a table or can we set them on the floor like wheels? Like, could we set them just on the floor beside a doorway? He said, the master tools should be elevated. You may position on a box or on a stand or on a table. Any structure which elevates. Yes. Good. Very good. Many blessings.